Good afternoon, freedom fighters of the world. Welcome to another great segment of walking on the Ryerson Station State Park Warpath. This is Terry Ronzio reporting to you from Occupied America. Yes, I uh, I was I was going to walk in Waynesburg, Pennsylvania today, but uh, my job and OPP plans. I don't know if you guys know what the OPP plan is, but when it, when I when I say that, that means other people's plans. Arr! <laughs> My main objective every day or every week is to do three to four times a week, walk three to four times a week, and it's so hard to do that. Uh, but I do it, and uh, four words, onwards. And upwards yes that's my goal and it's really hard I know I'm, I'm like after today's 10 mile March I'm gonna be at 9330 miles so I know no one's gonna catch me but I have to I have to do three legs of 500 miles every year and that's my goal uh, and well, every three miles I walk is to honor a soldier who has died in this war, in this terrible lie that we're fighting in. But uh, after, um, as always, when you find my videos, it's always the beginning of a great conversation. And this is what I call a wild card video. And you're like, what's a wild card video? And uh, check it out. I came up with a brilliant idea a couple months ago to actually film my videos without without basically a subject. And I would always bore everybody anyway with my personal thoughts in the beginning of the video. Like I always said, it's like the Twilight Zone or you remember those great TV shows, the, day, the days of old when there, a guy would come on and talk to you and then all of a sudden introduce, introduce you to the rest of the show. So that's what basically I do every time. But the conversation continues on my website. So, like I said, a brilliant, like a flash of lightning. Speaking of lightning, I call my my website the Ben Franklin Printing Press, right? So, uh, <laughs> so when a, I got this Ben Franklin lightning bolt one day, and like, Eureka! I will I will film my videos like I always do, and this saves me time. Like I said, time. It's so. I mean, it seems like the days go even faster these days, and 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 then now the days are shorter because of nighttime, and so it worked out. It was a brilliant idea, and I'm running with it now. So, yeah. So when you find my videos, don't be discouraged, and don't like have some patience, my friends. Patience. At the bottom of the video is the link to my blog like I said I call it the the Ben Franklin printing press and on there if you're having a hard time waking your friends up to the truth my website is the place to send people because number one my story of walking all these miles 29 pairs of boots this is my 19 flag every 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 500 miles I turn a flag in and I start with a new one. And one day, all my flags will go to a great soldier who has fought in, in this terrible war that we're fighting in, and or a, a military unit, or a veterans group. I give them the veterans group. So if you guys know some veterans groups that would like my flags, you know, one of my flags, because, um, you know, they're our greatest, our greatest patriots are of uh, the greatest patriots of every country any country are the veterans and the soldiers because they love and that's why they sign up they fight for you we the people and uh, our soldiers didn't sign up in this war to um, you know be tools of the new world order basically like I always can compare it to Star Wars the new world order is basically like Darth Vader and and the Emperor in Star Wars and unfortunately the troops of NATO 
and uh, the troops of the United Nations and and you know all uh, it's just terrible they they're they, all our countries have been hijacked all our greatest patriots have been hijacked by these bastards these elite motherfuckers I hate them I hate them and they've got us living in ten different parallels of reality man it's time to break all those parallels there's only one truth and we want it now 9-11 was the inside job man if you don't know that by now and if, if that offends you kiss my ass man all I do is study since 9-11 the truth so like I said send people to my website and tell them about my hard work it takes me three and a half hours to walk 10 miles and it takes me even longer to walk that far uh, when I walk on the Iroquois Warpath and I call where I walk the Iroquois Warpath Project Alamo if you haven't started my friends my friends and all my friends and uh, Patriots in my Patriot group called the Sons and Daughters of Liberty we're going around telling people the red coats are here the red coats are here start their own project alamo to have a place for you and your family to fall back to in case the shit hits the fan just to be prepared man it become like a, a big boy scout and girl scout troop combined and have patrols and it's pretty cool all right well i'll see you guys in the next video pass my videos to your friends like i said go to the bottom of the video click on the link and that'll take you to the rest of the conversation the conversation which you wanted to hear when you first clicked on the video i'll see you guys in the next video